Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel Cone Printing. In today's video, we will discuss about type style, type design, and desktop publishing. So, let's start the video. What is type design? Type design is the art of designing typefaces, font typeface, and type family. A collection of all the characters of typeface in one size and one style is called as a font. This includes caps and lowercase, numericals, punctuation marks and any special characters contained in the typeface such as the symbols and ligatures. The precise meaning of the term font is changing with the times. Originally, a font was a collection of a piece of wood or a metal type. They were specific size and therefore could only print only one size character. Modern typesetting technology can reproduce almost any size character from one digital font. Therefore, the term font and typeface while distinct from one another are often used in interchangeably. What is type family? The complete assembly of all the sizes and styles of typefaces forms a type family, bearing the name of its typeface. For example, all the styles and size of Helvetica from the Helvetica family, a type family may contain many variations. In fact, the Helvetica family currently contains more than 60 typefaces and styles, but will al always retain a strong visual continuity because of all the variations are based on a common design characteristic. This allows the designer to present some visual variety on a page while maintaining a strong unified appearance. The next one is the type measurements. The demand of a good design, readability and legibility, especially with a large amount of text, requires attention to the size of type, the length of the type set, or a column width and the space between characters, words, lines and paragraphs. There are three basic units of measurement used in working with a type, that is point, picas and EMS. Point, pica, inch conojas are as follows. One point is equal to 1 by 72 of an inch, 1 pica is equal to 12 points, and 1 inch is equal to 6 picas or 72 points. Points Points are used to measure height such as the type size height of the character and the space between lines and paragraph. The point size of a type is the height in points measured from the top of the ascender to the bottom of the descender, plus a variable amount of space above the below to keep typeset lines from touching. Picards Picards are used to measure width such as the width of typeset column, length of a line or the space between the columns. Picards are more convenient than inches because smaller spaces can be measured in a whole unit instead of a fractions. The next one is AMS and ENS. The EM space is based on the EM chord which is the square of the type size. For example, the EM chord of 48 point Futura is 48 point height by 48 points wide. The EM space measures 48 points. It is particularly useful for type measurement because instead of being static like a points and picas, it changes in a proportion to the size of type used. It is primarily used to control space between the characters and words and the space of the special characters such as the long dash or EM dash. The EN is a half of EM and the width of the EN dash. Importance of typography Typesetting is the composition of text material by means of types. Typesetting requires the prior process of designing a font and storing it in some manner. For a page layout designer, letters become a visual framework that gives readers their first overall impression of a printed page. A page designer must select a type of analyzing its visual appearance as well as readability of its typeface. While the choices may be many visitors of a daily newspaper for the sake of economy, workability and the convenience to its readers make deliberate attempt to limit the variations of the typefaces used in their page makeup. Many newspapers adopt just one typeface in different sizes throughout the newspaper. However, magazines and advertisers tend to experiment with the typography to give their pages and messages an eye-catching quality. Most common typographical mistakes First, homophones. These are the words which sound the same but have a different spelling and meaning. 
like a right right dear dear next leaving out the silent letters february and february and listen and listen adding an ending mistake can be made when changing the tense of the word by adding an ending hoping and hoping or submitting and submitting missing words most commonly with the smaller words to it is of a etc or sometimes these words are used incorrectly in exchange for one another ordering of letters the most common typos is for letters to be wrong way round the next one is a punctuation apostrophes are the most common punctuation mistake they should be used in two ways for possessive example rama's ball and to replace missing letters that is it or don't amalgamating words some words should be separate a lot rather than a lot verbs adapt the verb to a singular or a plural subject for example i was and we were not i were and we was should of or should have the latter is correct the next one is a desktop publishing that is dtp desktop publishing also known as a dtp combines a personal computer and a page layout software to create publication document on a computer for either large scale publishing or a small scale local economical multifunctional peripheral output and distribution user create page layout with a text graphics photos and other visual elements using a software such as a cork express adobe indesign and a free scribers microsoft publisher or apple pages and to some extent any graphic software or a word processor that combines editable text with an images for a small jobs a few copies of a publication might be printed on a local printer for a larger jobs a computer file can be sent to a vendor for a high volume printing scanner and image setter scanner is a device that optically scans images printed text handwriting or an object and convert in into the digital image common examples found in offices are a variations of the desktop or a flatbed scanner where the document is placed on the glass window for a scanning handheld scanner where the device is moved by hand have evolved from text scanning wands the 3d scanner used to industrial design reverse engineering test and management orthotic gaming and other applications mechanical driven scanners that move to the document are typically used for a large format documents where a flatbed design would be impractical modern scanners typically use a charge coupled device that is ccd or a contact image sensor c that is cis as the image sensor whereas older drum scanners uses a photo multiplier tube as the image sensor a rotary scanner used for a high speed document scanning is another type of a drum scanner using a ccd array instead of a photo multiplier other type of scanner are a planetary scanners which takes photograph of a book and documents and 3d scanners for a producing three dimensional models of objects the next one is a image setter an image setter is an ultra high resolution large format computer output device it exposes roll or sheet either photographic film or a bromide paper to a laser light source once the film or paper is developed a very high quality black and white image is revealed image setter output ranges in width usually between 12 and 44 inches the resolution of an image setter is typically between 1200 and 4800 dpi the image setter has been largely suppressed by the plate setter so that's all the basic you should know about the printing let's go to the summary printing is a process for a production of a text and images typically with an ink on a paper using a printing press it is often carried out as a large scale industrial process and it is an essential part of publishing and the transaction printing the art and science of making large number of duplicate reproduction of an original is termed as a printing it may be defined as the art of preserving all of arts printing is the medium for a printed communication the four important four periods of the history of the book 7 to 13th century the age of religious manuscript book production books is the period are entirely constituted by hand and are largely religious text whose creation meant as an act of worship 13 to 15th century 
the secularization of a book production, books are beginning to be produced that do not serve as an object of a worship, but that try to explain something about the observable world. The difficulty with the spread of such knowledge is that the production is still taking place via preprint manuscript methods. 15th to 16th century, the first printed books. They are the versions of traditional works like the Bible, books of our prayers, books and religious calendars. 16th to 17th century, new information is put into the books that have important consequences for the European life and society. There are types of printing processes. First, offset lithography is the most common printing process today. The workhorse, it offset ink from the metal plates to the rubber blanket cylinder and then to the paper. Almost every commercial printer does offset printing. Second, engraving. Engraving theme for a fine stationery produces a sh sharpest of all. Image fields indented run your fingers over the back side of the sheet. Most law firms still use as an engraving. Thermograph rays printing. Less expensive than engraving, use special powder that adhere to any color ink. Mainly used for stationery products. Reprographics general terms covering copying and duplicating. Think in-house copying departments and a copy or a quick printing shops. They take your originals and make duplicates of them. Digital printing is the newest printing process and the least understood. Includes all processes that digital imaging to create printed piece does, does not use the film. Think desktop or digital press for a short run and fast turnout job. Limitations include color, paper choices and the quality, but not for long and the technology is exploding. Letterpress is the original process found by the John Scuttenberg in 1440. Really printing like rubber stamps, images on the plate are higher than the surface. Fewer and fewer printers are doing the fine letterpress. Screen, also known as a silk screening. Ink is forced through the screen following a stencil pattern used for ring binders, t-shirts, bumpers, stickers, and billboards. Typography Typography is an art and technique of the design, modifying type glams and arranging type. Type glams characters are created to modify using a variety of illustration techniques. The arrangement of a type is a selection of typefaces, point size, line length, and leading line spacing, and the letter spacing. The next one is a desktop publishing, also known as a DTP. Combines a personal computer and a page layout software to create a publication document on a computer for either large scale publishing or a small scale local economical multifunctional peripheral output and a distribution. Users create a page layout with the text, graphics, photos, and other visual elements using a software such as the Cork Express, Adobe InDesign, the Freescribe, Microsoft Publisher, Apple Pages, and to some extent, any graphic software or word processor that combines editable text and with image. For small jobs, a few copies of a publication might be printed on a local printer, but for a larger jobs, a computer file can be sent to a vendor for a high volume printing. The term desktop publishing is commonly used for a described page layout skills. However, the skills and the softwares are not limited to the paper and books. The same skill and software are used to often create graphics for a point of sale displays, promotional items, trade show exhibitions, retail package designs, and the outdoor signs. If you have any question related to this video or printing, you can ask in comments. Don't forget to subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon.